Welcome to Xinhua Live. I'm Miranda Gao. I'm Sheila. We are both with China's Xinhua News Agency. Look, there is an old temple hanging on the cliff. Yes, this is China's famous Dragon Temple, or we can call it Hanging Temple. Yes, I must see it from the movies. I think it's a thousand and five hundred years of history. And today we are going to go up to the cliff and experience this fantastic and unique experience. Are you excited? I'm so excited. Me too. And today we'll invite some experts and other colleagues to join us to discuss why this temple can hang on the cliff for thousands of years. And now we have our Russian friend Alina. Welcome. Hello, I am Alina, and I am happy to be here with Xinhua today. Welcome, welcome. And we have another guest that is our tourism feature story writer and also Xinhua journalist Wang Xietao. Hello, I'm Wang Xietao. Very glad to join. Okay. Now we'll slip into two pairs and to discover this hang temple together. Are you ready? Yes. Yes. Let's go. Sheila, where is the location? Well, this temple is uh, built into a cliff and is near Hunyuan County in, in Datong city of North China's Shanxi province. Yeah, and it's in the Heng Mountain, the mm -hmm. one of the mo five most famous mountains in China. Oh, that's cool. And as you can see now, we can see from the side very clearly wood structure exposed to the air and the cross beams under the temple. This Hang Temple founded in 491 CE during the Northern Wei Dynasty. Although it has been expanded over the years, it is ancient and magical. Yes, and this temple is 75 meters above the ground. Yes, and uh, we are already climbing a twisting walkway to here. And you can see those terrifying scenery ahead of us. And yes. we are just going to explore. Oh, so okay, let's go. This, those are the stone walkway. As we walk up, you see the fantastic blue sky and those very ancient old feeling temples. I think woods are very fragile, but it can stand for so many years. Now we are appeared on a stone courtyard uh -huh. just before in front of the old temple. Yes, and you can see this stone yard provides me a kind of feeling of stability. Yes. But, uh, when I look at the wood structures lying ahead of us, I think my knees begin a little weak. <laughs> me too. I don't know. Still don't know if I can stand for that high. Mm -hmm. And uh, if you see from outside, you can see those red breeze walls around us. Mm -hmm. and this is the kind of structure that built uh, to set this uh, courtyard off the cliff and the sky. It's very beautiful. You can also see the scenery from outside. Green yeah. and the blue sky is quite amazing. Turn, if the camera turn back, turn back, you can see some colorful paintings, colorful paintings and uh, some details of the Tattoo. There's a dragon. It's very rare, right? It's dragon and clouds. Clouds and clouds flowers. Means, uh, good, good luck in Chinese, in yeah. Chinese culture. It, it's pretty typical kind of Chinese uh, pattern mm -hmm. on the ancient buildings. And it's a miracle that it preserves so well after one yeah, thousand, thousand of years. years. 
Now the sun is rising. She has say hi to the drones. Hi. hi. Well, spectacular view, right? For those the, who are just tuning, this is beautiful mountains around. We are live on Tsinghua Facebook, Twitter, YouTube channel yes. about our Tang Temple. Mm -hmm. It is listed by the Time Magazine as the world's top 10 most, most dangerous and odd building. Mr. Zhang, head of this cultural relic administration. Hi, welcome to have you with us. It's our great honor. And how long you have been working for this place? You've been working for this place for John said that he has been working for uh, this hand temple for two years. Now we're wondering uh, how and why this temple was built. Can you tell me why this temple was built? If we talk about this temple, the temple was built in 1998,一定要说到这个悬空市的修建。你知道说到这个悬空市那边的北魏战道。They said there is a northern Wei Dynasty building, and the, the typical for those plank. So, 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 so why why the wood structure can stand so many years without uh, beaten by ant? 就是这些物质建筑为什么能够挺立这么多年都不倒然后而且不会被白蚁蛀虫侵蚀悬空制千年不倒的主要原因呢 uh, why the temple is not fallen is because the location. The location is the key point. First,防虫蛀悬空室所用的木材是用我们当地最坚硬的一种铁杉木 The wood material is the local uh, wood that's called the iron wood, which is very firm and strong. 而且是用铜油浸泡了七天七夜之后,这才开始用作 and uh, the wood that is used for to support the temple is dipped into the tongue oil. 其次呢,悬空室它所处的位置呢,刚好是挖到香奥里边,分对它没有影响,雨水淋不到它,而且对面的这个山势有效的把这个阳光对它遮挡,所以说分雨还有这个阳光对它没有任何的影响,所以这也
Yeah, let's go. Let's, let's go. Let's turn to group one and to see how they explore this Hanging Temple. Careful, careful. Now it's a very narrow, like, uh, balcony. It's just, uh, yeah, the, the wide is just uh, for only one person. Yeah, and you can see from the right side, the reef, which is above the ground for 75 meters. 75 meters that is um, above the ground. I think it's about 50 meters high. Yeah, but don't look down. <laughs> Just don't go ahead. Down. Tell yourself don't look down, okay? And the, the cameraman, if you, you, you see up in the ceiling, you can see very beautiful structure. And it's very antique style, right? Uh, Thousands like, of it's history. It's like the, the skin of dragon. Yeah, some a lot of pattern like clouds. Some of the visitors said that they have very impressive feeling about those paintings on oh. Hang Temple. Yeah, that's quite beautiful. Yeah, some it's like the the skin of the dragon. Mm -hmm. Some like the cloud. Yeah, it's very beautiful. And the, touch the wood. Yeah, it's, the wood is thousand years of thousand history. Of years How about, do you feel about it? Uh, it's very smooth and it feels very comfortable. Yeah. And because it's touched by so many people. Yes. Just very okay. Clean. Now, you know, look ahead, there is a stone stairs ahead of us. And it's pretty narrow and carefully walk step by step. Yes. Okay. Carefully walk. And you can see some of the little short wall beside the camera on the right side and it's just uh, uh, around our knees, mm -hmm. right? Okay. Okay, now we are working on the stone walkway and uh, looking ahead, there uh, we can see totally very clear the understructure of the temple, right? And you can see there are some cross beams under the temple to support it is pretty strong and large and uh, some uh, some of the vertical vertical uh, woods are supporting from outside and uh, actually those woods are just for decoration oh and they are all together 37 uh, cross beams and 54 vertical woods supporting the hanging temple and you know two-thirds of the weight is counting on those cross beams and they are fairly ins inserted into the clip yeah, as you can see, the wide on the walkway is enough for only one person and everyone have to walk so slowly and carefully. Yes, one step by one step and pay honor to the God and, and the nature. Yeah, uh, you know, I really like those wall on this side. You can see because Heng Mountain is famous for its very strong and firm, you can see the stone struck here, one layer by layer, very dense. So why there is no landslide, landslide and no other <laughs> rock falling on this Hung Mountain? So that's why this temple is so strong. Right? Solid and firm. Yes, look at it. Very dense. Still here for thousands of years. Hi, let's go. <laughs> let's go. Now like, con let's continue to walk. And now we are walking to the wood structures here. And here, it's pretty, pretty tall and high. So we walk this way or upside? Upstairs, I think. Okay, it's the only so way. okay, so I can walk upstairs. Those are the wood stairs I had. They are covered by some irons. So people won't fall, fall down from the but stairs. But it's pretty tall and steep. Uh huh. It's just like very steepy. Okay, let's go. And each step is very high. Okay, let's go. Careful. Now we're walking to the main structure of the temple. I think the best way to keep on walking is not to look down and don't think about the reef, which is 75 meters above the ground. But I think the wood structure is very sturdy, and when I touch the handrail, I can feel the woods very smooth, very comfortable. And you know, everyone walk here just hold the handrail. We are to this side, okay. Oh my god, I'm so clumsy. <laughs> Careful. Okay, okay. <laughs> Left one foot step. first. One step by another step. Okay. I'm okay. Just okay. Wow, it's pretty tall. I try not to look downstairs. I just look ahead. Okay. Okay. Uh, it's some very beautiful scene. And you know, the paintings and the ceilings of this old temple. It touch it 
you can feel peaceful inside of my heart actually yes. you know <laughs> normally I would feel very frightened by this height mm -hmm. but now you can see I come here those are the statues the Buddha statues right uh-huh can you see clearly they are kind of standing in the middle of the air you can see those clouds mm -hmm. and yeah. they're all together 80 statues in this temple absolutely marvelous 80 statues can you believe that oh. hidden in those little cave inside the cliff and the hang temple I just wonder how Asian people can build this how how wonderful you see those paintings it's it's actually it? 3d yeah it's it's it have, <laughs> have different layers from inside to outside mm -hmm. okay it's great yeah, so, so yeah. I think it's make make those visitors who is climbing such high mm -hmm. can feel peaceful mm -hmm. and comfortable when they walk. Yes. Yeah. And let's continue to explore. Yes, oh, it's called San Sheng Hall. San Sheng means three things. Three things. Yeah. It's created by our ancestors. This is only one, only one person. Yeah. Okay. Now let's go to see those the uh, group group two. Uh, what is what are they? Let's tour. Oh, it's a miracle place. And do you know some interesting legends about this temple? Yeah, long long time ago, there was a monk on this mountain, and there was a monster on that opposite mountain. The monster destroyed the crops and the houses of people. So the monk helped the people to fight with the monster and finally defeat the monster and kill him. So people want to memorize the monk and build this temple. Can you believe it? Oh, it's a very interesting story, but I can't believe it. Yeah, it's just only a legend. Let's go to the world and find the real reason. Let's go? Okay, let's go. I, 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 I don't want to see downstairs because it's very, very narrow. For some people that are afraid of heights, they have to walk down. <laughs> walk close to the wall For those yeah who just uh, brave enough like me you can walk just like me but if you are afraid of heights move like Miranda do like a crab stick to the wall yeah, crab. So don't have to, okay okay don't have come to down crab. come down you know oh, see yeah. there is uh, some Buddha too I can see them their face inside the little little okay. cave careful Thank you, you can our see cameraman. very That's very beautiful Buddha statue and see some lotus yeah and uh, uh see outside wave hi hi okay the drones okay that's all let's continue okay yeah okay actually we're just uh, walking in the most famous china's hang temple now with we are at uh, the highest point the third floor the highest point and you know yeah the and needs of quite very very narrow and uh, actually i do want to press the like button our cameraman because he moves backwards yeah. oh my god careful in. careful oh there's a very steep slope behind us so careful cameraman okay don't worry you just walk ahead don't worry about us don't worry about yes you just walk ahead don't okay so now it's much better now because uh looking ahead uh, so here's grab some hand be careful yeah you can you can grab some handrail yeah you can see actually Sheila you can uh -huh. feel the woods are very firm right mm -hmm. but I still feel my legs are shaking yes be careful, be careful. Uh, there here is a little bit uh there's a slope of okay we say hi to the Hello, how are you? This is China Taiwanese. We are in the Hang Hang Temple. Temple in North China, Shanxi Province. So and we are just across the highest point of the temple. Yeah, it's feel awesome. You know, I can, I can just Take feel the breath. air. Yeah. The air working here. Yes. And everyone's move very slowly. Once you can see those there. prettiful china here. It's green. The color is green. Yeah. And a lot of Buddha statue in the in the in the right side. There are a lot of Buddha statue. There's there's a big one. Wow. 
pay honor to the God and nature, right? And uh, just the left side, beside us, is a seven hundred seventy-five meters high cliff, and we just walk. And everyone just climb, climb down the. Yeah, oh. it's very narrow. The walk is very narrow. Okay, careful, careful. Everybody just. Okay, now we are going downstairs. It's a good news. <laughs> Okay, I got it. Okay, okay. Oh, don't, don't. Wow, we are walking into those ah, those stone structure. Wait, wait, which side? Which side? We can see those inside. Inside is the little cave. I think there are a lot of little cave in Hong Mountain. We know. I think the the geology part is that you can. There's more densive layers of the stone and rocks inside the cliff and the cave. See, very, very strong. Right yeah, right. firm. Okay, let's continue. It's very slippery. Yeah, let's Watch go. Out. Oh, I think I will have oh, to careful, careful. Down. Careful, careful, ah. careful. <laughs> okay, let's go. Okay, now let's okay. continue to walk downstairs. Ah. The stairs are very, very tall. Okay, I hold your hands. Be strong and believe in yourself. Have courage. Embrace the life. Okay, let's go. Oh wow, there's the Buddha too. And the analysis said that this is the only temple in China that had combined the three religions: Confucius, Buddha, and uh, Taoism. Yeah. Of course, you see the colors quite. Colorful. <laughs> yeah. yeah okay. Some Just little girls stand beside the uh, statue. Little girl statue and uh, the main statue. Three of them. And, they are, they and the are ceiling. Snakes. You can the ceiling have a lot of dragons, dragons on the round the circle. Quite uh, with amazing. flowers and the green leaves and some clouds. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So it's still amazing that they can preserve it so well after 1,500 years. Yes. Okay, so, let's go. Let's go. There are lots of tourists behind us. They want to move fast because they are afraid of heights. Yes, very beautiful sight see. I feel more comfortable when we're downstairs. I can't believe I have already finished such a hard task. You can believe we just finished climbing the top 10 most dangerous and odd architectures in the world. Yes. And I think it's the longest walk in my life mm -hmm. because I feel a little, a little bit terrified when we're walking on the air. Uh huh. When you're in the first floor, you can barely speak. Yeah, I'm speechless. <laughs> <laughs> you, you must come here to have this feeling because it's a test to your courage. Mm -hmm. I think most people feel the same way when they first come here because they're afraid of the heights. But when they think about that this temple has existed for 1,500 years, they should take some faith of the ancient people to build this temple. And you can, you, you can say it exists for 1,000 years. It can uh, um, protect from the erosion of wind and sunlight. Well, after you challenge your courage, you can enjoy the beautiful sea and the mountain and the sky. And also the sun feel, let me feel very warm now. Well, it's a miracle that the temple can stand for how many, so many thousands of years. Yes. And we just feel so wondered that uh, Asian people can build such an amazing temple into a cliff that's quite spectacular. Yes, I hope you enjoy the tour with us. Mm -hmm. And uh, maybe we can yeah, see no. you next time about more wonders in China. Mm -hmm. Next time when you come here, remember to bring a pair of good sports shoes. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> okay. okay, see you next time.